game will be coming to you live from St. Louis, Missouri. Happy holidays, everyone, and thanks for joining us. We're here for another holiday version of Madden NFL football as the Broncos get set to take on the Rams. Al Michaels and John Madden here to broadcast this one, brought to you by EA Sports, the company that defines football. One thing that can turn an average defense into a great one is the guys up front. When you have someone like this who consistently puts pressure on the quarterback, it allows the rest of the defense to drop back in coverage and not have to blitz or pressure as much. And when you can do that, offenses have a tough time getting things done. The Rams will need their running game to be at its best, otherwise they could be in for a long day. The best way to neutralize a good defense is by running right at them, so look for this back to get a lot of carries early on. They'll also use the run to set up a few long throws if they see that that safety is creeping up to the line of scrimmage. Now this is what you call excitement. Look at those guys down there. They can't even stand still. Let's go to midfield for the coin toss. Both teams have taken the field, and let's see what happens now as we're ready for the kickoff. Here's the kickoff team. He got all of that one. He takes a knee. The offense heads out into the field for the first time. Get some time in the pocket and be patient with it. Don't force it into cover. Under pressure, throws it, and his pass is completed. Warner hit his target, and they have a first down. This guy makes the tough catches look easy. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 34. Using split back. First and ten. Ball on the 34-yard line. That all you got? Dropping back to pass on first down. Looking for a receiver. This pass is incomplete. The blocking broke down on that play, allowing the defender to get to the quarterback as he was releasing the ball. He really had to rush that throw. That was a situation where the defensive line made the job easy for the defensive back. So, John, we expect a lot of big plays in today's game with two of the best offenses in the NFL. The thing about both these teams is they're not just one-dimensional something doesn't work they make the adjustment and they come at you in another way I'm looking for lots of big plays in this one throwing that one goes off the receivers hands and it brings up fourth down drops on third down that would have gotten you a first down can really demoralize the team your quarterback makes a good throw but the guy in the other end can't come up with it Laville is the deep return man here's the punt fair catch and they're ready to go on offense for the first time. Now, smart coach would call this defense. And off to the tailback. He's taken down at the 34-yard line. Give this defense a shot. With the pass, and it's caught, and he's knocked out of bounds at the 42. Running to the right side. Picks up about four on the toss. You should stop him with this play. Davis, the lone setback. Cross play to the left. He's taken down in the backfield by Collins. He starts out the wrong way and winds up losing yardage. Yeah, they got good penetration on the line. The guys flying to the ball, getting to the ball carrier, making a heck of a defensive play. Number seven. Gets set. Pressure, throws it, and he hits his target. That play was executed to perfection. And when we were watching them in practice, they were running this play. That's almost one of those sandlot types of deals where you go long and I'll get it to you. Get in there. You got back. Get in the 
get the call. Four, maybe five yards on that carry. Call this defense here. Second and six. Ball on the 21-yard line. It's the toss to the left. So he picks up a couple of yards, but he's exhausted and heading for the sideline. St. Louis looking for the pass as they line up with seven defensive backs. Pressure coming. A lot of space to play. Right here is how he can hurt you. They get him in a third down situation. And if they can give him a lane to run through, he's going to take it. And right there, he takes it for a big first down. Make it move. Ain't got nothing. Get the ball. Going to the air on first down. Rosen, great pass. So a pickup of maybe three. You should stop him with this play. to the right. Lost about a yard. Now it's third and nine coming up. Ball on the 13-yard line. Come on, 11th man. play of this drive. Hit him low. Throws it over the middle. Drops the interception. John, that went right off the defender's fingertips. Yeah, he had an excellent opportunity to end the drive right there. He just couldn't bring it in. Elon comes out, hoping to put points on the scoreboard for the first time. And it's up. A nice kick, and it's good. Kickoff team lines up. And he got all of that one. A great kick. And they were about ready to get this drive started after the last series ended with a punt. They'll go from the I formation. Warner sees something in the defense. And he's taken down in the backfield. Romanowski was right there, stopping the play for a loss. I tell you, that comes from watching a lot of film and knowing the tendencies of the opponent. That was a heck of a play. Set. Second and 13. Ball on the 17. Yard. Directing traffic. Stay up. Let's go. Come on. Red. The Rams using motion. Flag down. Red ball, play of game, on the offense. Penalties come down to discipline and maintaining it on the field. And the offense didn't show much discipline there. Set. Closing in, guns it to the right side. To the team. He flings that pass right to his receiver. That quarterback rarely throws a bad ball. The Rams come out in the bunch for me. To the air on first down. Under pressure. Roll it. And it's complete. He found the soft spot in the coverage, John. The receiver did a great job reading the coverage. He found the hole in the zone, and the quarterback found him in that hole with the pass. Warner using split backs. Ball on the 40 yard line. Drops back, gets rid of it. Nice pass and good catch on that play. The pass was fired in there so hard, I think he left smoke in the ball. The Rams line up with two backs behind the quarterback. Set.
Passing on first down. Pressure surveying the field. Gets the pass off. This offense having no trouble moving the ball on this drive. Yeah, and this defense is having a lot of trouble stopping it. They can't seem to key on what they're doing and put an end to this drive. Calling an audible now. Using motion. You give it to the halfback. He plows ahead. Decent gain there, but he's going to head to the sideline for a blow. See if you can break this defense. Look downfield for a long pass. Quarterback back in the shotgun. Dropping back, pressure coming. The defense has it. Win the run. The 40, the 50, the 40, the 30. The defense forced him to rush that throw. Yeah, they were bringing the house. Back to the field. Call this defense here. Following the interception, it's now first and Let's ten. Let's go, come on. Crosses it out to the left. A yard, maybe two on the count. A smart coach would call this one. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 24-yard line. That will be the final play of the first quarter. And we have a close one so far with the Broncos ahead of the Rams. 3-0. And we're ready to start the second quarter. Get out! Man Good in job. motion. Huh. Huh. Give it all you got, huh. Pete. Come on. Davis. The five yard pickup on that run by the tailback. Five yard game the quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. Get at him, Pete. That's all you Using motion. it off he picked up good yardage on that play yeah, and he got a great push from his offensive line you can credit them for that first down it off again and the halfback picks up about three a smart coach would call this play only one man in the backfield Number seven with a man in motion. Davis. Gain of two. Off. Touchdown, Denver. And he's able to get open in the end zone. Great play. The defense just seemed to lose track of him down there. They have to do a better job keeping the play in front of him so that that kind of thing doesn't happen. They'll get set for the extra point. And it's on its way. And the extra point is good. They didn't have to go very far in that last drive, John. Took advantage of the short field for the touchdown. Your job as an offense is not to worry about how long or how short of a field you have to go. Their job is to produce points. When they do, it fires up the defense to get out there and give them the ball back. Give the defense a lot of credit on that last possession as they were able to force the interception. Let's see what happens this time. The Rams line up with two backs behind the quarterback. He's looking. The pass falls incomplete. The defender was able to get in there to disrupt the pass. Oh, the defensive coordinator is pulling out everything. He's throwing his whole arsenal at him right now. Looking for a receiver with the throw. Incomplete pass. A jarring blow on that one. Well, he saw the receiver hauling it in, and then boom, he pops him, and it ends up incomplete. 
corner. Sets up. Using motion. Stop moving. Get in there. That's you. That's you. Snake up. Drops back. Under pressure with the pass. He's out of rhythm on this drive. Can't seem to get it going. I tell you, they're giving a lot of different looks on this drive. And the quarterback's having a tough time adjusting on those last few passes. Tootin lines up in the backfield for the punt. LaVille looks like he's ready for the return. Here's the kick. Fair catch goal for it. That was a smart thing to do with the coverage team closing in for a big hit. First and 10. Ball on the 43-yard line. It's the toss to the right. Davis didn't get any help from his offensive line. It was just about impossible to run when you have guys in the backfield just as soon as you snap the ball. Give it off. Run through the tackle. The running back gets about three. The Rams come out with one linebacker and several defensive backs. Backing off. Pressure. Rolling. Thrown behind, but caught. When you think about guys with great hands, he's very close to the top, John. I'll tell you what. He does a great job of using his hands and not letting the ball get into his body. He's worked very hard to improve his pass catching, and I think he's become one of the best out there. Number seven. Get set. Is that all you got? Toss play to the left. Pick up of about eight. You should stop him with this play. Nothing here. There we go, Brown here. Turn the lights down now. Pressure coming. Gets the pass off. This pass is incomplete. The defense has had difficulty stopping them on third down. Come on, be up. He'll get the call again. Davis covered some good ground there. Hey, nice job up front. Holding their block and allowing him to get a good run for a first down. Man in motion. You got him. Again with the carry. So they'll lose yardage on that tackle. He doesn't get much there and he needs a breather as he looks to the sideline. Second and nine coming up here. Number seven. Get set. Let's go. Hands it off. About a four yard gain there. The Rams line up in the quarter defense. the grab. They move the chains on the third down catch by Smith. I'll tell you, as far as hands go, this guy's one of the best in the business. Go across the middle or get down the field. But you know that he's going to make the catch. Gets the call. Just about seven yards on that carry. Heck, this is a good one to call. Eleventh play of this drive. Here comes the heat. Closing in. Rowan. Sharp. Picks up just enough. They have the momentum here. They're darn near unstoppable on third down. They've just been calling the right plays at the right time. Davis lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Looking for room. I just keep letting him run it. 
seven yard game. They line up in the eye formation. Second and goal. Ball on the two yard line. Get in there, line. Set. Mad dog goes. Hunt. 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 play to the right. Not a whole lot on that carry. They'll take himself out of the game for a play or two. So now we have third and goal. Ball one foot away. The corners move up to play this one tight. Number seven. Get set. Hand it off. This is a good special teams play. St. Louis calls a timeout. That's their first. Healing. Heads out to try this field goal. The kick is up, and that kick is right on target. Another successful field goal try gives him his second three-pointer of the game. Should be a return here. From the one. The offense couldn't get anything going on their last drive, going three and out. If the offensive line can maintain their block. Yo, Looks like he's calling an audible. The Rams using motion. Ball. Pickup of about a yard of the run. Let's move this football. So two minutes left before halftime. The key here is to step up into the pocket. Make sure you get those feet set before you throw it. Set. Dropping back. Throwing. Comes up with it. Nice ball going to the air. And that'll move the chain. First and ten. Ball on their own 34. Set. Under pressure. With the throw. He has it. Warner could have knocked the wind down the receiver with that first down throw. Now that's a quick release. The quarterback decided where he wanted to go with it, and boom, it was in the receiver's hand. Set. Huh. Throwing on first down. Pressure. Hits his receiver in stride. They've got something going here. Yeah, it's been one first down after another. They're putting together a nice looking drive here. Set. Huh. Pressure coming. Scrambling. Throws it. On the run. They complete the pass for the first down. That showed awareness by the receiver. He knew just where he had to go to get the first down. Cross the marker and then look for more. Fall the deep back. Pass play here on first down. Closing in. Looking for a receiver. Rowing. Find him. He has it. That guy did a great job bringing the ball in. That receiver has it all. He can run and catch with the best of them. The defense better make sure that they have him covered. And this is the seventh play of this drive. With the pass. Bruce is doing a good job finding the open area in the coverage, and that's his third catch. They'll call this play at the line of scrimmage. Eighth play of this drive. Throws it, and he hits his target. So it's first and goal. About three for the touchdown. Sideline to sideline. Come on, be up. Looks like he's calling an audible. Fall. They'll go with a play fit. Under pressure, so they'll lose yardage on that tackle. St. Louis calls a timeout. They have one timeout left. You need to watch the guys up front on this play. They're going to be passing. And the best thing the defense can do here is to get some pressure on the quarterback. Either throw a pick or taking them down for the sack. As they get ready for this third down play, we'll take a look at it how they've done today. Third down conversions are usually a good barometer of how well your offense is playing. It means that your offense is making big plays when they need them. Touchdown, St. Louis. You better kick it here. They'll get set for the extra point. And it's on its way. The extra point attempt is good. Number two. He's just about ready to kick this one away.
Good distance. From the two-yard line. It's the end of the second quarter with the score. Denver, 13. St. Louis, 7. St. Louis, 7. Let's get back to the action on the field. Let's take a look at our halftime stats. And the kickoff team comes out onto the field. Not a bad kick. They'll set up for the return. From the six. Can't bring him down. Ball loose. The Rams are there to pick up the ball. John, he's hurt. We'll get an update from Melissa as soon as the extent of the injury is known. Well, John, we figured we'd have a tight game, but I really expected a better play offensively in this one. Yeah, it's always a little funny to see a game with two great offenses turn into a defensive struggle. But late night watching film is really paying off. You may want to dump that play, John. Yeah, that's what this defense will do to you. They're so good in pursuit that if you start trying to go east and west in the backfield, you're in trouble. I try and run the ball right at them. That'll negate the speed that these guys have to the outside. Directing traffic. Williams moves in motion. Breaks free of the defender. They'll bring him down at the 23-yard line. This is a time to look down the field. Look for your guy to find a hole in the defense and get him the ball. Holt goes in motion. Gets the pass off, and it's complete. Falk pulls in that pass, making his fourth catch of the game. Denver comes out in their nickel packet. Warner sends a man in motion. With the pass, he hits his receiver. I'll tell you, this has to be frustrating. Watch here, because it's a great situation for the defense. They think they've got him, and they're about to get the ball back. Then all of a sudden, he drops back to pass, and boom, they're moving the chain, and they're getting a whole new set of downs. Looking for a receiver with the throw. Behind him, he has it. With yet another, he is up his total to five today. Warner sees something in the defense. Holcomb, the motion man. Cross play to the left. Gain of about a yard there. This is it. Give the ball to your halfback. Let him find the seam and get into the end zone. Get out of here, Set. Take him out. Is that all you got? Deal. The Rams call a timeout. They have two timeouts left. Third down now and goal to go. Ball one inch out. Warner gets set. Against the run. Touchdown, St. Louis. Now this is exactly how to get the ball in the end zone. Just get in behind the center guard and keep pushing and pushing until they're putting up six points in the board. Lines up for the point after. And it's up, and the extra point is good. They were set up with good field position and were able to make the most of it by getting the touchdown. Those are the kind of touchdowns you have to get. Because if the defense forces a field goal or a turnover, it's really a victory for the other team. And you can often swing momentum the other way. Sends it sailing. 
from the five. Missed tackle. What a collision. The Broncos will start the drive from the 24. <laughs> this defense will stop them for sure. Davis misses the tackle. Decent game, about four. <laughs> this defense will stop them for sure. Cross play to the left. Gain of about one. With the carry. One yard gain on the play. St. Louis looking for the pass as they line up with seven defensive backs. Drops back. This is a good special teams play. Room will come into this game to punt. Hakeem sets up to run back the punt. He's waving for the fair catch. There was no need to try and return that one. But he made the right decision there. First and ten. Set. Yo, Directing traffic. Man in motion. The 40. Good blocking up front and a nice game on the count. Yeah, and that was a perfect call in that situation. He did a nice job avoiding the first wave of defenders and converting for the first down. Warner gets set. Pressure coming. Throws it. And it's complete. The 50. That reception moves the chains, and they pick up a first down. And as a receiver, you have to be ready for any type of pass. He did a good job of hanging on to that last one because it got there in a hurry. Set. Bring the pass. He sees something in the defense. Holcomb moves in motion. Hands it off to the back. A team has to show discipline and execute properly out there. If they don't, they'll find it's much harder to overcome the other team and get a win. Dimebacks in for this play. Ball on the 47 yard line. Here comes the heat. Throwing on first down. Closing in. Looking deep to the right. This pass is incomplete. Nobody home as he overthrows the receiver. He just flicked his wrist and the ball just took off. He just needed to take a little bit off of that one. And it could have gone for a big play. Nickelback in this time. Using motion. Dropping back. Under pressure. Throwing short to his left. He finds his man. And they finally make the tackle at the 29. Tell your line to protect here. Tell your line to protect every play, not just here. You need to get some time back there and let someone get open. Set. Bulldog under. Get the ball. Get the ball. Cut hot. Here come the heat. Get in there. Stay up. Man in motion. Touch it away. Here's an open. He's at the 20. Falk with a nice run and picks up the first down. And it was well executed. They hit their blocks in the back down the right hole to get down the field and pick up a first down. Warner sees something in the defense. The Rams using motion. Another run. Pick up of about six yards. You're in a good position here. Get the snap, drop back, and let your guys get open. Don't force anything. The Rams Yellow. holding on by less than a field goal. Blue, 
Drops back. Pressure. Hard throw. It's broken up. Have a look at this big defensive lineman. He couldn't get to the quarterback, so he got his hands up, and he knocked it down. The goal from the I formation. As they get ready for this third down play, we'll take a look at how they've done today. Third down conversions is a keeper stat. When you convert on third down, you keep three things. You keep your drive going, you keep their defense on the field, and you keep your defense resting on the sideline. And he's ridden out at the three. Punch it in there. First down and goal to go. Fault, the lone back. Looks like he's calling an audible. Yellow, 58. Yellow, 25. Come on, tee up. Pro comes in motion. Pressure coming. Flings it to the outside. He was able to avoid the sack, but couldn't find a way to get that pass to his receiver. I really like the way this defense attacks the offensive line. They're very aggressive, relying on man-to-man -man coverage on the outside to shut down the receivers as they bring guys from everywhere on the blitzer. Right up the middle. Not much there. Yeah, they opened up the hole for him, but there was someone waiting on the other side. Third and goal. Four yards to the end zone. Closing in, surveying the field. Buying time to the end zone. Almost picked off. Almost picked it off in the end zone. Yeah, and if he could have come up with that one, not only does it take away the scoring threat, but it gets the ball back for your offense. Warner sets up. Blitz is coming. With the adjustment. Slips behind the secondary and got open for the touchdown. Now that's just how they practice. They go over this play all the time in practice. They use it a few times in just about every game. But let me tell you, most of the time it's successful just like that. Dropping back under pressure. This one falls incomplete. Just what they were looking for, John. Good play calling there. Key drive. Touchdown. Hey, as an offensive coach in this league, you're always making adjustments. And hopefully you can get the defense on its heels and get it in there for the touchdown. Good job by these guys. Nice distance. From the two. Their last drive ended with a three and out as the offense comes out onto the field again. So they have first and ten here. Ball on their own 23. Davis, the lone back. Sharp. The man in motion. Davis couldn't find an opening and was brought down very quickly. Yeah, he was. This line has to do a better job of holding up at the point of attack. He has a fast first step. He can explode through the hole. And he needs a line to create that little crease or cutback lane to break free. The teams are set for the fourth quarter of play. Second and ten. Ball on their own 23. Set. Eagle left. Get in there. They'll go with the run once again. Pickup of about a yard in the run. The Rams line up in the quarter defense. St. Louis is trying to prevent anything long here and backs up the corners and safeties. Now this is one heck of a play. Look at it. You're in a hole here on third down. And they come through with this perfect play that gets him a first and keeps the drive going. Looking upfield. Nice play fake. Gets the pass off. Number seven. Floated it out there. And the receiver was able to bring it in. And that's a typical timing pass where you lead the receiver to a spot. And when he gets there, he just needs to make the catch. St. Louis backs its secondary off the line to be in a better position to defend the deep pass. The quarterback thought he had that one. You got to deliver the ball out there quickly, but it has to be catchable. You got to use some touch. 
St. Louis doesn't want a long pass over anybody's head here, so they back up the secondary. Hurry to him. McCaffrey is the recipient on that one, his third reception of the game. There's no hesitation here. They're going to go for it. Give it all you got, Keith. Come on. Throws it on the run. Watch how they get it done when the pressure's on. It's fourth down. They just call a great play, and he puts the ball right where it needs to be to pick up that first down. Number seven sets up. Davis. Picked up nine on the play. This defense looks good. The backs are lined up in an eye. Breaks the back. And he's brought down at the five-yard line. And this is the tenth play of his drive. White stops the play in the backfield. They were waiting for him as he's trying to take it to the outside. And that run started off going east and west, which isn't bad. But then it got worse, and it went south. Only one man in the backfield. Off to the tailback. Touchdown, Broncos. Here's how they get in on that one. They just can't bring him down. And he plows into the end zone for the score. Elam comes in for the extra point. The kick is up. The point after is good. But John, these teams are very evenly matched. This makes for a better game, I think. The strategy of the game comes into play here more. And obviously they're happy with that drive, especially since they ended it with a touchdown. The defense was on the field for a long time, and they just couldn't stop it. Give credit to the offense for doing such a great job of executing. Get some time in the pocket and be patient with it. Don't force it into cover. Good gain of about seven on that play. You might want to drop back a little deeper on this play. Step up in the pocket and let her fly. Denver comes out in their nickel package. Ball on the 29-yard line. Dropping back. Pressure. Gets rid of it. Breaking through. Perfect pass. Great catch. And that'll move the chain. Trying to catch the defense napping. Fake the run and look to send it deep. The backs are lined up in an eye. Pressure coming, throwing, and he makes the grab. He throws a perfect strike. That was one heck of a throw. You could see him setting for the pass, then boom, it was gone. Closing in, gets the pass off. Oh, beat the coverage on that pass. Soft hands like that are hard to find. This guy looks like he's a keeper. And here's what they've been able to do so far on third down. Third down is when you want your players to dig deep and make a clutch play. When you convert, it gives your defense a little extra rest, and it gives your offense a fresh set of downs to work with. Using motion. Running right. Here's an opening. The 40. Breaks free. Runs him over. John, he's hurt. We'll get an update from Melissa as soon as the extent of the injury is known. Get some time in the pocket and be patient with it. Don't force it into coverage. The backs are lined up in an eye. Ball on the 32-yard line. Passing on first down. Under pressure. Throwing short to the right side. 
The receiver had to stretch to reach out, get up there, and make the catch. I don't think that guy had any other choice. If he didn't jump up where the ball was, it was going to go right over his head. Warner with a man in motion. Pressure. Gets rid of it. Off target. And he gets it. That's three times in this drive they've been able to pick up a first down. Yeah, and the thing is, they'll be doing more than just picking up first downs if this success continues. They're going to be picking up some points. We got nothing. Drop back. Drop. Set. Stay up. Three. You see Six something three. in the defense. Right. Williams Six comes goal. in motion. Hut. Look at that power. Good pick up with about six. Get the ball to the open man. You can't give him an easy pick. The quarterback lines up with two backs behind him. St. Louis will call a timeout here. They have one left. Second and four. Ball on the 13-yard line. Fault, the deep man. Warner directing traffic. He'll get it again. And he gets the first down with a nice pickup on that play. Someone needs to tell this guy that you should be slowing down in the second half, not speeding up. Two minutes to the final gun. You need to play it a little safe here. Run the ball and pick up a few. You're almost there. Tenth play of this drive. He gets the carry. Runs him over. Ball couldn't escape the pursuit and was cut down quickly. These guys up front are very tough to block because they can use their size and strength to get excellent leverage on running plays. Sometimes they struggle a little with their consistency. But they always seem to be a big factor when the game's on the line. They're in a great position to win this thing with a field goal. If I'm the coach, I'm just calling a run up the middle and setting it up for my kicker. Give it all you got. Denver will call a timeout here. They have two left. Warner sees something in the defense. Again, he'll get the call. The defense is going to have to make sure they don't let them pick up the first if they want their team to get one last shot. It should be a run, so they better get ready to stop it. Crosses it out to the right. Tackle at the two-yard line. Ball couldn't even get out of the backfield. This defense is extremely active and effective up front. They do a good job of getting upfield quickly, creating havoc in the backfield. And misdirection plays and draws can be a good way to use their speed and aggressiveness against them. So we'll see if the field goal unit can come through here. Cross play to the right. Touchdown, Rams. Great rushing touchdown there. Yeah, he knew where he wanted to go, and he got there. So he crosses the goal line to double his rushing touchdown total. So they'll try to tack on the extra point. Look, this is the point after. Here's the kickoff team. They'll return this one. From the five. The Broncos will start this drive from 27. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 27. Backing off. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. Dropping back. He did his best to make something happen there. Yeah, but the defense contained him. There was no way they were going to let him out. They got after him pretty quickly there. Drops back. Steps up into the pocket. He hits his receiver. Third and five. Coming up. Nice job so far on third down for the offense, and we'll see if that continues here. 
Jumps up and comes down with it. Bush stops him at the 45-yard line. They're going to keep it moving here. They're heading straight to the line. Hill stopped the clock with the spike. Second down now. They have to get closer to the end zone. The corners are backing off. Gets the pass off, and it's caught. How about that speed? Great individual effort. Not only did the quarterback show off his strong arm, but the receiver displayed some amazingly soft hands. A great throw with an even better catch is always an easy way to pick up first down. Not much time remaining, and they'll have to get closer for a legitimate shot at getting the touchdown. Looking downfield with the throw. It's his receiver in stride. Clearly, they were on the same page on that play. These days, offenses rely on a short, quick pass, and the receiver gaining lots of yards after the catch. St. Louis will call a timeout here. That's their third and final timeout. On the 26-yard line. Number seven. Sets up. The corners playing back. Drops back. Gets the pass off. Off the ball, he makes the catch anyway. That pass was a wobbler. Yeah, that was an ugly-looking pass. But I'll tell you, it got him the first down they needed. And it looks like they're going to go no huddle. Spike stops the clock. The defense concentrating on one thing only, not letting anybody cross the goal line. So what the offense has to do is create a passing window with the patterns they run so the quarterback can fire one in there. If he gets pressured, he has to just throw it up for grabs and hope one of his guys can find a way to come down with it. Dropping back. Throwing. This one falls incomplete. A little too much on that pass, resulting in an overthrow. Looks like he might be pressing a little bit out there. He needs to be a little more patient, find his receiver, and then deliver the ball on a spot that his receiver can go to. Throws it. Hits him on the run. The gun signals the end of the game. The final score is St. Louis 26, Denver 20. For EA Sports, this is Al Michaels and John Madden wishing you a very pleasant good evening. Paul is our horse trailer player of the game tonight.